Hello, Hollow Valley Avengers. I have here a worn shirt that I have wore in this movie that you're going to see here in a minute. If you liked my autographed t-shirt, this will be posted on eBay at 7 a.m. The video will be playing at 8 a.m. So if you want my autographed, personal autographed t-shirt, a worn t-shirt, has my smell on it. Sorry, didn't wash it. So if you want eBay, this is what you look for in that. It's already posted. You look that right up on eBay, and uh, you'll have my stuff on there. And I'll put on description that I was wearing it on the movie. So happy bidding! You'll be on for ten days, starting at ninety-nine cents plus shipping. Thanks, y'all. Hello, this is Halibut Adventures. I've actually made it to a house. And I've posted on my YouTube channel that my, something is coming to our channel new. So this is new to me. What it is, this house has been vacant for three months. Three or four months. And it's owned by a crazy woman. And stuff is still here. And look power still on. It's not been turned off. I heard the, the woman and there's a big oh I better watch myself. Neighborhood dog I'm here early this morning. I'm gonna talk too loud when you travel. To where I'm actually going to the vacant house. There's stuff left here galore. Look at that. So, boy, the story. The story is uh, that's my car back there. You see it? I pulled up in here. And I shouldn't have it. The only spot I can pull up in here. See? It's fake because this, this neighborhood is actually a dead neighborhood pretty much. There's like houses for sale everywhere around here. There's like probably maybe four people living in this neighborhood. And I think there's one here, but I heard that this person is real old. And they don't do nothing really hard at all, so I think I'll be okay. But the story was this uh, woman went insane and disappeared. So I don't know. I don't know. This is exactly a full story. I'm just kind of hearing rumors and stuff, but the house is vacant. And they said that uh, she's been there for three or four, three or four months. And it's, they're doing this place of being at a scary house, ghostly house, I guess. Because it's a 1955, and there's been some battles. There's been some bad hogs over here. I won't get in trouble when I turn get inside. There's been some bad hogs in here that I heard that uh, that her husband, family, the collector people, and oh my gosh. Hold on, I'll be back a second. Actually, I'm back you all. That actually was uh, one of those security people going around the neighborhood and wondering what I was actually doing. I just told him I was just thought this was his house for sale and I had to leave real quick and come back. And he's gone. He's, he, I've been watching his rounds is like every hour and a half. But look, I did find out though this day since he's open because I heard that there's no key to it and he's still actually even not open. Scary spooky house for saying. He said there's no one to be a paranormal in here. Okay. If it's this darn scary, I don't know. That's probably why it's been vacant and the family's left everything in here because they don't want to touch nothing or bring anything home to them. And I heard they're going to demolish this house with everything in it. I'm not going 
Those are all the legs. I need to get a way out of here. Got a freaking key in there still. Alright. Like I said, they going to tear everything in here. What's in this house is going to be demolished because it's too haunted. They said that, uh, that they're afraid to take anything with them back out. The family, just, it's just like three families pretty much whacked each other. Okay, let's go to the rest of the house. Here is the other part of the room. There's a lot of stuff in here. I turn on the light in here because this is part of the back. I'm going to get in trouble. In here, and it's been like this for three to four months. And believe it or not, look at here. This woman still has. They have light on key from people coming in here. There's pictures on the wall. I don't want to show them on the wall because privacy stuff. Door I came in at. Look at this. Still stuff in here, and it got fish in here still. Look. Can't believe us. Three months. Three or four months. This woman used to be a crazy woman. I heard. So I don't know if, what kind of. Family stuff she's got. There's. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. They must be in the collector of people here. See, I'm on the line. Look at that. She's got a freaking moonshot in here. Hang on, let me see if I got a light on my thing real quick. There you go. Here's my light. I'm surprised this stuff stayed in here for three months. No one's ever came in here and grabbed this stuff, which I don't do stuff like that. It's very stupid and ignorant. Computer stuff. I won't go further than that because there's personal information over there. She disappeared or something. I don't know what's going on. That's the real true story about it. Hi everybody, <clears throat> I'm back again on the end of the video that I actually did notify that security guard and they actually notified the family members to this woman 
and I figured I was going to be going to jail for trespassing, but evidently the family member said not to press charges. It was meant to be for me to come here and see her in there, and thank goodness she ain't dead. Evidently she showed up. She was sleeping in that bed. And they said, thank goodness that she didn't hear me, I would have my whoosh, that quick. She had a uh, boot knife in her, underneath her, her pillow when they got a hold of her. So evidently she's going back to the crazy house. And they said they are going to definitely demolish the house. I've kind of mentioned the stuff that they collected in there. That was an awful lot of stuff in there. I know they got Mushan in there and they also got other things in there too as well. Collectible items. But with this, they are going to take that stuff for sure and sell it because uh, it's got value to it. But the other stuff will be gone. So, all right. I hope you like this. Let me know if you do or not. Please comment. Like I said earlier, it's the first time I ever did this, and I guess it came had to do thing. But let me know if you want me to do another one. This is the very first one. I won't do another one for a while until I get all these likes and comments. All right. Thanks. And have a good day. You all like this kind of content? Let me know and give me that thumbs up so I know if you like it or not. If not, I won't make another one. This is my very first one I ever ever did in my life, and it's freaking scary. So whoever does this on a routine thing, thumbs up to you all. I might get killed at this one. <laughs>